Hi everyone, my name is Jeff and today I shall be running through with you a little demo of how we can actually use Aruba's ClearPass Policy Manager to onboard IoT devices, um, do a fingerprinting of the IoT device and from there send that particular role to a Aruba wireless controller and we actually place very granular ACLs um, for that IoT device. So basically, I've uh, created a secure dash IoT underscore demo. So we are going to do Mac, ba Mac based authentication for the uh, endpoint device that's coming onto our network. So ClearPass has the capability to do uh, device fingerprinting and profiling for any sort of devices coming onto the network um, using DHCP fingerprinting, using Mac OUIs, and a whole host of different techniques. From there, we are actually creating various roles for the IoT device. So if the IoT device is unknown, we will actually place that role IoT device into quarantine. Uh, if the IoT device is known, so we have actually pre-created some roles in our system, uh, for example, for Raspberry Pi or Apple TV, and we will actually push down uh, different enforcement roles to the Uber wireless controller such that these devices can access various resources on the network. So let's take a look at how that looks like uh, for a endpoint device. So over here I actually have a uh, Raspberry Pi device and it is actually configured to have the capability to serve uh, any sort of websites that is amazon.com um, and we have actually restricted access to anywhere else. So as you can see here my Raspberry Pi device is not able to actually serve to uh, youtube.com or google.com. Basically, that browser is just uh, in spinning mode and it's not able to resolve or reach um, anywhere outside of the network. So this is actually connected to the um, IoT SSID called Aruba-IoT. So you can use that same SSID for um, various users or various devices that's coming on and different users will have different profiles and in this case what happens is that a uh, particular Raspberry Pi device is actually configured to only be able to access Amazon. So over here similarly I have a iPad so on my iPad I have actually configured it to connect to the same SSID or Aruba-IoT so let's see if the device is able to serve to various uh, websites. So let's try going to uh, youtube.com. So as you can see, my iPad is actually up and running. It's able to serve to various websites. Um, so based on the same SSID, I'm able to control the access rights of the device that's coming onto our network. So um, that's how we can actually leverage the power of ClearPass to profile our IoT devices and have very granular access control um, for different device factors. Right? So that's all from me today. Thank you very much.